Now, therefore, be it known that I, William Phillips, Acting Secretary of State of the United States, do hereby certify that the amendment aforesaid has become valid to all intents and purposes as a part of the Constitution of the United States. Joseph H. Choate, Jr., President Roosevelt's newly appointed federal liquor. One, to see that each state controls the sale of liquor in such manner as it believes proper. Two, to arrange that pure liquor shall be available at a reasonable price. Three, to eliminate the bootlegger to as great an extent as may be possible. trapped in here. Well, you see, Mr. McManus, the, lo the law say you can't drink at the bar, so I'm bringing the bar to you. What are you going to have? Oh, fine. How about a double Manhattan? That's me? right. All right, go ahead. Make it Oh boy, that's how we want it to be cold. Uh, Very cold. 